objective of this exercise is to demonstrate how to acquire and convert digital evidence utilizing Forensic Imager. Within Forensic Imager there are three main options acquire, convert and verify an evidence file. In this initial phase we will acquire a USB thumb drive. Within the window select the device to image both physical and logical partitions are now available for processing. Once the subject device is selected, choose the sector range and select the next button. The source section shows the device being acquired. There are three types of evidence files that Forensic Imager can create. Encase, Raw DD and Advanced Forensic Format. Only the Encase file can be compressed using Forensic Imager. Note, the compression option is not available for both DD and AFF formats. Using the NCASE format, the default segment size and good compression navigate to where the evidence file is to be stored. Give the evidence file an appropriate name relating to the case and select Save. The file path where the evidence file will finally reside now appears in the output file area. By default, Forensic Imager will create an MD5, SHA1 and SHA256 value for the evidence file being created. It is important to ensure the Verify Image hash after creation is selected at this point. Enter the information relating to the case in the Details area. It is important to understand that the Details section of this window cannot be changed at a later stage after the evidence file has been created. Once all the information has been added, perform a final check that the information is correct before selecting the Start button. The evidence file will now be created and saved to the chosen storage area. Within the Progress section, both the data transfer speed and time taken to create the evidence file is displayed. An event log is also simultaneously created for the acquisition. This will accompany the final evidence file to validate its integrity during the process. The hash verification values will appear in the event log area as they are performed. A verification and match will appear at the bottom of the acquisition process window when the entire process has finally completed. Forensic Imager, as previously discussed, can convert one evidence file format to another. Select the Back button and navigate to the Forensic Imager main page. Select the Convert button. In the Select the Image File to Convert window, select Add Image. Navigate to the evidence file to be converted and select Open. Highlight the evidence file and select Next. Select the new format for the evidence file, DD in this example. The source, destination and case details are still available from the previous acquisition as Forensic Imager was not closed down. Navigate to where the new evidence file is to be stored and change the Save As Type to the format of choice from the drop down menu, DD in this example. Select the Save button and the Source, Destination and Details window will once again appear. The output file name will now reflect the new evidence file format. Ensure all the case details and processing options are correct. Select the Start button and the conversion process will now be performed. The acquisition process and event log windows will now be displayed. Converting one file format to another is much faster than the initial acquisition. Confirm the evidence file hash values match and the process is now complete. To confirm the evidence files have been created successfully, navigate to where they were stored and review both the evidence and log files that accompany them. It is also best practice to open the evidence files within Forensic Explorer. To confirm the date within them is both legible and consistent with the investigation's expectations.